Hey everybody, welcome back to Quinn's Cones. I'm your host, Mr. Cones, and as you can see, we're out of the office. We're back in the car. We're en route to Dairy Queen. Last week we looked at McDonald's vanilla cone. Today, Dairy Queen vanilla. We're gonna compare the two. Just a quick, harmless back and forth, see which one's better. Let's get this one done quick. Without further ado, let's cleanse our palate, put it on the plastic, and enjoy some ice cream. Let's do this. Okay, so I put the camera at the most flattering angle I could. The way the sun is right now, this is what Batman would look like if he had a sunburn. I'm darkness, I'm the night, I'm Batman. Hi, welcome to Dairy Queen, what can I get for you? Hi, could I please just get a small plain vanilla cone? Small plain vanilla cone, anything else? That's everything. 335, please. Hey, right, thank you. <laughs> Always be polite, kids. Always be polite. Hi there, 335. Hi. On debit, please. Thank you. Me, nothing. Oh, no thanks. Hey, thank you. You too. Okay, so we made it through the drive-thru. I don't know why there was such a long line in the middle of November, but <laughs> we're here. <laughs> so first things first, just pure presentation, just visually, this is a way more aesthetic cone than the McDonald's one. The McDonald's one, it was sloppy. It's like someone dropped it on the floor before they gave it to us. It's just little leaning tower of pizza e for me. I prefer my dairy straight as an arrow. This has got a little bit of curvature to it, but not as bad as the McDonald's one. Dairy Queen does have a reputation of being a bit more bougie, a bit more higher quality than McDonald's. So let's see if it lives up to the hype. Let's jump into that first bite. Mm. And yes, before anybody comments, I do bite my ice cream. I know that's a sin, but Mr. Cones don't mind. Mr. Cones don't mind. Mmm. So first bite, it does have that kind of fast foody ice cream taste that the McDonald's had, but it's a, a little bit more muted. Not as exaggerated or overwhelming as the McDonald's one. It does also seem to be a bit more of a stiff soft serve as opposed to the very flimsy and milky one from McDonald's. Less maintenance is definitely required. I'm gonna have to give the first bite a four out of five. It was it's really good. This is some really good sauce serve. So for texture, this is some of the smoothest dairy my palate's ever experienced. This is some really clean dairy. I'd have to give the texture a four out of five, not a five out of five. I feel like there could just be a little bit more whip to the ice cream, just make it a bit more smooth. It's kind of hard on that first bite, but it's really good. I really like the texture. Goes down easy, and there's nothing to complain about, really. For aftertaste, I believe I gave the McDonald's one a 3 out of 5. I'm going to have to give this a 4 out of 5, because like I was talking about earlier, the kind of stale fast food vibe that you get from all of these ice creams from fast food places, it's a bit more muted in this, and so it doesn't linger as much afterwards compared to the McDonald's one. It's almost like, this is like a, like a more eco-friendly car as opposed to the McDonald's diesel engine, you know? It's just a bit more clean going down. So now we're getting to it, the best part of the ice cream cone, the part where you get a little bit of cone and a little bit of dairy. It's my favorite. Mm. This isn't a nice bougie waffle cone. This is just your run of the mill ice cream cone. So it's nothing too game changing. It's identical to the one that McDonald's has. They even got the same paper paired with the edible glue. Or as you can see, we got the Dairy Queen in the back right there. So for wow factor, I think I gave the McDonald's one a two. I'm gonna have to give this one a three. Overall, this is a better cone. I was surprised that it tasted a bit more real, a bit more premium than the McDonald's one, but it's Nothing, it's this ain't no Ben and Jerry's half-baked, I'll tell you that. So one word to describe the Dairy Queen vanilla cone would have to be classic. This is a classic dish. If you have had ice cream in your life, chances are you've had Dairy Queen. It's such a popular brand. It has such a nice reputation for itself. It's been around for so long. It's just classic. It's classic. I also one day hope to be dubbed the Dairy King, so it's only fair that I try the Dairy Queen's cones uh, one day so thank you guys for watching this has been another episode of quinn's cones i plan to one day make quinn's cones the movie i want to try every flavored blizzard at dairy queen and that's going to be a long video so thank you daffodifel and okage for that idea i'm going to try to make it happen quinn's cones the movie 
Stay tuned, subscribe if you don't want to miss it. If you like this video, drop a like, drop a comment. I love reading them. I got a very, very, very nice comment on Reddit from a, from a lovely subscriber and oh my god, I shared it with all my friends and family. It just made me feel so good about myself. So thank you for sending that to me. It really did brighten my day. This has been another episode of Quinn's Cones. I'm your host, Mr. Cones, and take care. Have a great day. Go try some Dairy Queen. Just do it. Just do it. You forgot about the essence of the game. It's about the cones.